Dash channel RNL Live. In today's video, I'm going to be doing turning my foam squishies into paper squishies part six, I think. Maybe. Uh, I don't really know what part I'm doing, but before I begin, I do have two shout outs. Without further ado, let's begin. So here are the two squishies I'm doing today. The pineapple is literally so defected, but you know what, it's okay guys. So um, before I actually begin, I wanted to have you guys vote if you want me to do the blush bun or the this cake in the next one I do. So you guys are going to comment down below, um, hashtag cake or hashtag blush bun. Um, because I will be doing another part of this. So which one do you want me to make into a paper squishy next? The blush bun or cake? And then without further ado, let's begin. I am going to be starting with the pineapple, so I put it to the side. Okay, so I went ahead and started, so I got some paper and a pencil, and I started to draw just the actual pineapple design copying the pineapple squishy because it was right there. So I put my paper in half and I started. So I just drew it out and honestly it didn't turn out as bad as I thought it would, but it didn't turn out great. But I went ahead and just went with it and I think I did a pretty good job, I guess. Um, without coloring it, it kind of looked like a weird blob. But I went ahead and just drew the, I drew everything else and then went over it with like a Sharpie thing. And then I went ahead and colored in the um, sunglasses because they were black. And it was starting to look better. So I went ahead and just kept on outlining everything because for a better effect. And you can do this with Sharpie, any black marker or anything will work. And then I was done with the outline, so then I had to just color it. So I started with like the stem on top and just took a green. And I honestly didn't think this green was light enough. I thought it was way too dark. But I went ahead and just went with it because like it's too late, you know. Um, but I mean it wasn't that dark I guess, but it was dark. Then I went ahead and just went with my yellow and I didn't have a marker so I used colored pencil for this. And I just colored the rest of it with yellow. So then I went ahead and cut it out, and, and then after you cut it out, you want to tape the bottom half, so that way you have room to fill it, and I, before I taped it, actually, I tried to make the bottom of it, like, swerve, kind of, but then I just end up messing it up, so then I tried to even it out, and it just looked horrible, but you know what, it's okay. So then I took my tape, and I taped up half of it, the bottom half and if you don't understand what i'm doing go back to the video i made like i think it was a month ago it was a long time ago where i made a squishy and i showed you how like step by step but um anyway so i went ahead and did that and then i was ready to fill it so what i went ahead and did i just took some pillow stuffing now if you don't have pillow stuffing you can always use plastic bag garbage bag tissues cotton balls I recommend using bags or obviously foam, like plastic bags work really good I know of. But you don't want to put too much in or else it will become dense. And I don't know if this is a thing, but I feel like I was using like dense, dense paper. And just taped um, what I had, or the I went ahead and taped the top of it up and then after i take the top of it up uh you want to make sure that you are taping up the front and back of it like i will do in a minute because if you don't it, when you squish it the paper will wrinkle and your hard work will come to waste um i'll just go ahead and show you how to do it so you just want to take a piece of paper like this put one on the front then um take one put it on the back and then your squishy is complete. Product, so here is the real one. It's, it's, um, yeah. And then here is the paper one. Okay, this is one of the best paper squishies I've ever made. It's like, it feels so nice to squish. I don't, I don't color the backs, but like, if these are the same size, I think I did a pretty good job. Um, the only thing that I think looks bad is um the color of the stem i feel like i did this green way too dark you guys can see that but you know what? overall i think this was a pretty good one 
but I like I love this picture. Moving on to this one, I will be doing the same step. This one I'm gonna go through a little faster since you already know the step. But anyway, I'm just gonna do the same thing. So I get the paper, fold it in half, just draw the design. Um, yeah, and you know what? This design was actually harder, believe it or not, at the bottom of it. And sorry, like my pencil, like the top of it is just in the way of the camera. Sorry about that. But you know what? I just tried and I went ahead and drew the eyes and the stuff. And then um, I went ahead and colored it. So I took this like permanent marker thing and I just colored it red because the squishy, you know, was um, red. And I did it just all around. And But I obviously didn't color the eyes red because the eyes were white and black, not red. So really um, nothing too extraordinary, different. Just did the simple squishy. And then after I colored it, I went ahead and got my scissors to cut it. Out, which you'll see right now and then I went once it was fully cut out I just taped the bottom of it this one was actually easier to tape I don't know why um it just kind of was um so I went ahead and just did that so then I actually just filled it with pillow stuffing like I said earlier you can use plastic bag garbage bag works pretty good yeah so here's the finished product of this one. So here is the real one, obviously. And then here is the fake or paper one. And honestly, this one is, uh, I, I actually like the dense paper. I think it worked out better than the other paper. But uh, I like how, like overall, I feel like the mouth, it just doesn't look like this one. But the eyes kind of do, the shades of red kind of do. So here are the two finished products. We have the pineapple, we have the octopus. Comment down below which one you think turned out better. I honestly have to say the pineapple. I mean, the teeth look pretty weird, but um, I don't know. I just kind of like it better. But yeah, also make sure you comment if you want hashtag blush bun or hashtag cake to be featured i guess i don't know to f be featured in my next video so i can turn it into a paper squishy and thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed and i'm going to try to be posting more often and give this video a like and i'll see you next time on my channel i'm gonna lie bye guys and hope you enjoyed